Welcome to the system help video, Performing an Exam. To begin scanning, tap the Scan button on the startup screen. Press the upper depth control to decrease the displayed depth, or press the lower depth control to increase the displayed depth. You can also adjust depth on the clinical monitor. You can adjust the gain on your system in several ways. Use the gain wheel. Use auto gain to automatically adjust the image. Use the TGC control and the touch panel to adjust the on-screen gain controls for fine control of the gain profile. Or adjust the gain directly on the clinical monitor. Many of the system's image controls are available using the touch panel. You can view more controls and even optimize the placement of the controls to suit your needs. Now, tap the icons on the orientation control to adjust where your image is on the screen. The optimization control automatically optimizes your image if you need to scan shallow or deep structures. Tap Res for the best possible resolution. Now that we've optimized the image, let's freeze it by pressing the Freeze button. When the image is frozen, you can take a measurement. Watch the help video, Taking Measurements. Now let's change to M mode, which provides a trace of the 2D image displayed over time. Slide the M line to the desired spot on the screen using the touchpad or touchscreen, and then press the Update control to activate. Let's go back to 2D to look at color. Press C, then adjust the color parameters such as box size and placement. Use the Color Scale control to change scale. You may need to tap the More Control button to find the control. To change to Color Power Doppler, tap CPD on the Color Type control. You can use CPD to detect very low levels of blood flow. Use the touchpad or touchscreen to position the D-line and gate. Horizontal movements position the D-line and vertical movements position the gate. To correct the angle of the gate, use the Angle Correct control on the touch panel. You may need to tap the More Control button to find the control. Press the Update control to activate Doppler. If you are performing a needle procedure, take a look at needle profiling. Needle profiling can help visualize the needle during these procedures. You will still need to use movement and fluid injection to locate the needle tip. Now it's time for you to explore on your own. Watch the help videos online or refer to the System User Guide.